killing the spaghetti. She's killing the spaghetti. She didn't even make the meatballs. She ugly, terrible meatballs. Wait, what? Now the next video we're watching has been watched by hundreds of thousands of people from a channel called Six Sisters and I really want to see what she's did because lots of views sent me this video, a lot of views sent me this video, so <laughs> let's see. First of all, I am flattered that your audience would send my video to you. This is funny because this video is actually four years old. Today I am making spaghetti and meatballs in the Instant Pot. <gasps> I'm a little bit scared. Instant Pot? Are you cooking the meatballs in there? Or the whole thing. Yes. Am I gonna cook it in the instant pot? Yes. Yes, I am. <gasps> She's killing the spaghetti. She's killing the spaghetti. Ah! To an Italian chef, yes, I probably am killing the noodles. Thankfully, I am not a professional chef. So first, I'm gonna add the spaghetti noodles. Now, I'm only using half a pound of spaghetti oh. noodles. Why? Why are you this with spaghetti? First, call them spaghetti. Don't call them noodles. For me, noodles are the Chinese noodles. So this is different. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Now, I want you to realize I can't even get the names of my children straight. So you can bet your booty my pasta is gonna change names. It's just how it is. Pasta, spaghetti, really, it's all the same to me. Now, watch as I layer them. So they're gonna lay on the bottom and then I flip directly. Are you doing layers? What are you doing here? Come on. Why, yes, I am. I'm betting he doesn't have an Instant Pot because he would know. That's how you cook spaghetti noodles in the Instant Pot. So they won't all stick together. If you switch directions a little bit, it will cook evenly. Oh, now I'm gonna use- That so looks so sad. Marinara sauce is already done. Okay, I hope it's a good brand. I never tried it. Actually, it's one of my favorite brands and it's a little bit cheaper than the real expensive kind because right now, Things are expensive. 24 ounce can of spaghetti sauce. Now I'm going to try and- First she called them noodles, and now she's calling them spaghetti sauce. I'm a bit confused. What are you using here? He might be just a little sensitive about the name of his noodles. Now in order to avoid the burn notice on your Instant Pot, you're going to add one cup of water. Next, I'm gonna take my favorite kind of meatballs. I she didn't even make the meatballs. She bought them from the from whatever it is, frozen or whatever it is. Those ugly, terrible meatballs made with no meat, fake meat. My dear friend, there are many reasons why I didn't make the meatballs. First off, I am a wife and a mom of five active children. Along with those five kids, I have a four month old. Not only that, I am running a business and so time is Height. To be honest, the only alone time I get is when I sneak into the pantry and eat my Oreo for the day. So my friend, that is why. Like homestyle meatballs, you can also use the Italian meatballs. These are- if, Well, if you make it a pasta, you use Italian meatballs. You don't use Swedish meatballs. You can use whatever you want, but spaghetti meatballs or Italian from Manona's town, you change the recipe already when you came to America by adding wrong pasta, wrong sauce, big meatballs. And now you're telling me that you can use any meatballs you want? So it's best to call them noodles and meatballs. You know, that is the nice thing about being a stay-at-home cook. You can do whatever you want. They're frozen, so I'm just throwing them on the top and putting the lid on making sure it's sealed tight and you're going to turn your knob to sealing knob. I haven't used this on pot yet. I'm pretty sure it's an incredible machine. It can really change your life. But really, how much do you save by doing this? I knew it. I knew he didn't have one. Okay. If you need a little bit of help, my friend, I have an Instant Pot course. I'll put it down below in the description for you. That way you can learn to cook with it and it will change your life. Next, you're gonna push your pressure cook button and go up to seven minutes. Now, I was at a soccer game with his end. Only seven minutes? You can't do this in the pot for seven minutes? I don't, I don't, I don't get it. Why is this gonna help your life? He obviously does not understand. When it's done, go ahead and take the lid off and your spaghetti and meatballs should be all good to go. Now, if you had a burn notice, go ahead and take your lid off and you can put- But my question is, I'm going back to the spaghetti or noodles. Why do you cut them? Why is it the obsession of people cutting the spaghetti or the noodles? Actually, there are a few reasons. The first one is, they don't fit in the Instant Pot, so you have to break them so they'll fit. The second reason, have you ever tried to feed a five-year-old or even a 12-year-old spaghetti noodles being this long? It is a mess. Why is it difficult to do this? It's so beautiful. It's like, it's the best part of eating spaghetti to do this. 
to get the right spaghetti. You have to do this. If you cannot do this, man, you have problems in your life. You know, we all have problems in our life. Thankfully, rolling noodles correctly is not one of my problems. Push the saute button and finish cooking your noodles by hand with the saute function. Now she called them noodles again. <sighs> noodles, pasta, spaghetti. <sighs> they all know what it is. Noodles are at the texture you want. You should be good to go. Now, if you didn't have the burn notice. What texture do you want? Al dente. Maybe a little bit more soft than al dente. Maybe you want to cook an extra minute from al dente, but you can't overcook the pasta. You're killing it. Yeah. I probably am, but I'll tell you what, my kids are eating it and I think it tastes pretty good. Now I love meat in my spaghetti, but sometimes I don't have time to brown the meat. This meatballs in this spaghetti is a perfect alternative. Okay, you like it? I'm happy for you. Thank you so much for sharing your recipe. Thank you so much, I really appreciate it. You are welcome and thank you for having me on your channel. But one thing that will help you out, getting an Instant Pot. Change your life. Now in all seriousness, this was just for fun. I actually had a lot of fun making this video. If you do go over to his channel, make sure you're sending him some love. We don't want any hate out there. But if you are looking for easy Instant Pot recipes, I have plenty for you right up there. Okay guys, I'll see you next time.